If you're here, it's probably because you're tired of feeling stuck, tired of being average, and tired of giving your all only to be left behind. I get it. You've been working so hard, pouring your heart and soul into everything you do, but it feels like no matter how much effort you put in, you're always falling short. You're not alone, my friend. Today, we're diving into something that could change your life forever. Imagine waking up every day with unshakable confidence and living a life that others only dream about. Sounds amazing, right? Well, today we're going to explore Hamza's proven formula for building an epic life. This isn't just about success, it's about creating a life that excites you, a life that you can truly be proud of. Hamza, the YouTube sensation who turned his own life around, has shared his wisdom, and I'm here to break it all down for you. In this video, we're going to cover the exact steps Hamza took to transform his life from ordinary to extraordinary. We'll talk about the mindset shifts, daily habits, and practical tips that will set you on the path to greatness. And trust me, you'll want to stick around till the end because I'll be revealing some spicy secrets that Hamza uses to maintain his success and happiness. So, if you're tired of feeling like you're never enough, if you want to break free from the chains of mediocrity, and if you're ready to step into a life filled with confidence and purpose, you're in the right place. Grab a notebook, sit back, and let's get started on this journey together. Because today, we're not just talking about living your dreams, we're making them happen. But before we start, make sure you subscribe to our channel. Number one, the power of mindset. Everything starts with your mindset. The way you think shapes your reality. If you believe you're destined for greatness, you'll act accordingly. If you think you're doomed to mediocrity, well, that's exactly what you'll get. Think about it, every successful person, from athletes to entrepreneurs, will tell you that their mindset was a critical part of their journey. It's the foundation upon which everything else is built. Hamza often talks about adopting a stoic mindset. This means staying calm and rational, no matter what life throws at you. It's about focusing on what you can control and letting go of what you can't. Imagine you're driving a car. You can't control the traffic, but you can control how you respond to it. Getting frustrated doesn't help you move faster, it just ruins your mood. A stoic mindset helps you stay composed and make better decisions. You have to do something to adopt this unwavering mindset. Start by practicing gratitude daily. Write down three things you're thankful for each morning. It shifts your focus from what's going wrong to what's going right. Next, challenge negative thoughts. When you catch yourself thinking, I can't do this, replace it with, I'm capable and I can learn, it's about reprogramming your brain to be more positive and resilient. Try to surround yourself with positive influences. The people you spend time with, the books you read, the content you consume, all of these shape your mindset. Choose wisely. Number two, the role of testosterone. Listen carefully. You have to understand how high testosterone levels can impact your life. Testosterone isn't just about muscles and masculinity. It's a crucial hormone that affects your confidence, energy, and focus. High testosterone levels can make you feel more assertive, driven, and less prone to anxiety and depression. Think of it as your body's natural performance enhancer. When your testosterone levels are optimal, you feel like you can take on the world. Here is some of Hamza's advice on naturally boosting testosterone. When it comes to increasing your testosterone, you can't skip exercise, especially weight training, is one of the best ways to boost testosterone. When you lift weights, your body responds by producing more testosterone to help repair and build muscle. Hamza often emphasizes the importance of compound exercises like squats, deadlifts, and bench presses. Also, proper nutrition is key. Foods rich in zinc, vitamin D, and healthy fats are crucial. Think nuts, seeds, fatty fish, and eggs. Avoid processed foods and sugar, which can lower your testosterone levels. Getting enough sleep is another critical factor. Your body produces the most testosterone while you sleep, especially during REM sleep. Aim for seven to nine hours of quality sleep each night. And reducing stress is also important. Chronic stress leads to elevated cortisol levels, which can negatively impact your testosterone. Practice stress reducing activities like meditation, deep breathing, or spending time in nature. With higher testosterone, you'll find yourself more assertive, more driven, and less prone to anxiety and depression. It's a game changer for anyone looking to elevate their life. You'll have more energy to pursue your goals, more confidence to take risks, and more focus to stay on track. Number three, daily habits for success. Your morning routine sets the tone for your entire day. Hamza's morning routine includes activities like meditation, journaling, and a quick workout. These habits help clear your mind, set your intentions, and energize your body. Start your day with a purpose, and you'll be more productive and focused. Meditation helps calm your mind and improve your focus. Even just five to 10 minutes each morning can make a big difference. 
Journaling allows you to reflect on your goals, your progress, and your gratitude. It's a great way to start the day with a positive mindset. A quick workout, even if it's just a 10-minute stretch or a short walk, can boost your energy levels and set a positive tone for the day. For Hamza, physical fitness is non-negotiable. According to him, regular exercise keeps your body and mind sharp. Hamza suggests a mix of cardio, strength training, and flexibility exercises. Cardio improves your heart health and stamina strength training builds muscle and boosts testosterone and flexibility exercises like yoga keep you agile and reduce the risk of injury. Time management is crucial. Use techniques like the Pomodoro technique to break work into manageable chunks. This involves working for 25 minutes, then taking a five minute break. It helps maintain focus and prevent burnout. Prioritize your tasks. Focus on what's important, not just what's urgent. Make a list of your top three priorities each day and tackle them first. Try to create a workspace that's conducive to productivity. Turn off notifications, set boundaries with others, and schedule dedicated time for deep work. Number four, building confidence and overcoming shyness. Confidence comes from competence. The more you do something, the better you get at it and the more confident you become. Start by setting small, achievable goals and building from there. Celebrate your successes, no matter how small. For example, if you're shy about public speaking, start by practicing in front of a mirror. Then, try speaking in front of a small, supportive group. Gradually increase the size of your audience as your confidence grows. Practice speaking up. Start small, like saying hello to a stranger or contributing to a group conversation. Gradually push yourself out of your comfort zone. Visualization can also help imagine yourself succeeding in social situations. Another exercise is to practice active listening. When you're focused on truly listening to others, it takes the pressure off you and helps you engage more naturally. Being assertive is about respecting yourself and others. Practice saying no when you need to and stand up for your beliefs. Body language is also important. Stand tall, make eye contact, and speak clearly. Start by setting boundaries. If someone is asking too much of you, it's okay to say no. Your time and energy are valuable. Use I statements to express your needs and feelings. For example, I feel overwhelmed when I'm given too many tasks at once. Can we prioritize them together? Number five, social dynamics and relationships. Understanding social dynamics can help you navigate interactions more smoothly. Be genuinely interested in others, listen more than you talk, and be empathetic. Ask open-ended questions to encourage others to share more about themselves. Show genuine curiosity and interest in their stories and experiences. Practice active listening. This means fully focusing on the speaker, understanding their message, and responding thoughtfully. It shows respect and builds trust. Always prioritize quality over quantity. Focus on building deep, meaningful connections rather than trying to be popular. Invest time in people who support and uplift you. Look for common interests and values. Shared experiences and goals can form the basis of strong, lasting friendships. Be vulnerable and open. Sharing your thoughts and feelings can create deeper connections and foster mutual trust. It's important to set boundaries. If someone is taking advantage of you, address it directly. Be firm, but polite. Remember, you teach people how to treat you by what you allow. If someone continues to disrespect your boundaries, it might be necessary to distance yourself from that relationship. Surround yourself with people who respect and support you. Number six, goal setting and achieving dreams. Goals give your life direction. Without them, you're like a ship without a rudder. Clear goals help you focus your efforts and measure your progress. They turn your dreams into actionable plans. For example, instead of saying, I want to earn money, set a specific goal like, I want to make $5,000 in three months. This gives you a clear target and timeline to work towards. Hamza uses smart goals specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound. Break down your big goals into smaller, manageable steps. Track your progress and adjust as needed. Be specific, be measurable, set achievable and relevant dreams. Try to be motivated and disciplined. Motivation gets you started, but discipline keeps you going. Find your why the deeper reason behind your goals. Use reminders and routines to stay on track. Celebrate your small wins to keep yourself motivated. For example, if your goal is to write a book, your why might be to share your story and inspire others. This deeper purpose can help you stay motivated when the going gets tough. Number seven, maintaining success and happiness. Consistency is key. Keep refining your habits and routines. Stay curious and keep learning. Adapt to changes and stay resilient in the face of setbacks. Success is not a one-time event, but a continuous journey. Keep pushing yourself to grow and improve. Embrace a growth mindset. 
See challenges as opportunities to learn and develop. Stay open to new ideas and experiences. Balance is crucial for long-term success. Make time for hobbies, relaxation, and relationships. Don't let work consume you remember to live your life. Schedule regular breaks and downtime. Allow yourself to unwind and recharge. Pursue hobbies and interests outside of work. They can provide a sense of fulfillment and joy. Invest in your relationships. Spend quality time with family and friends. Build a support network that you can rely on. That's all for today. Today, we've covered a lot from mindset and testosterone to daily habits, confidence, social dynamics, goal setting, and maintaining success and happiness. These are the pillars of Hamza's formula for building an epic life. Remember, change doesn't happen overnight. Start small, be consistent, and believe in yourself. You've got this. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share it with someone who needs to hear it. Let's build this epic life together. Thanks for watching.